Hey guys, what's up? Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Steam games on an SD card. So, yesterday I bought a new Samsung uh, Class 10 micro SD card um, mainly to uh, put my games on it because the internal 64 gig SSD isn't enough for installing. Um, for example, if you install Dota on it, it takes around 10 to 12 GB. So, um, that's a lot of space uh, considering it's only a 64 gig hard drive. So I went and bought a uh, 32 gig uh, um, uh, Samsung Class 10 micro SD card. Um, I hope you can guys can see it here. It's already around 40% full with the game. Uh, I only have Dota to install on it right now. And I'm gonna show you how to install any Steam game on this thing. On an external storage. Um, this tutorial will work for any computer running Steam. So once you have launched Steam, um, you click on Steam, the main menu, and you go to settings. Uh, once you're in the settings, go to download. Uh, I should have used some on-screen capture for this thing. Anyways, you go to downloads and you go to Steam library folders. Uh, once you're here, um, as you can see, I've already selected it, but uh, if you want to add a new folder, you click on Add Library Folder, and from the drop-down menu, um, you gotta select D. Um, in my case, I selected D because D is my micro SD card. Um, if the driver differs in your computer, you gotta select that. So, once you have it selected, um, one and then when you install a game such as I'm trying gonna show you if you click install on this machine it's gonna give you an option to install directly on the SD card uh, you can either install it on C drive or you can install it on the SD card it's that simple so yeah and the part of and another part of this video I'm going to show you the loading time uh, it is a class 10 micro SD card and the load I have noticed the load time is significantly higher than what it was and, and when I had installed the game on C drive and I'm gonna click play and show you how long it takes for the game to load uh, it does take a while so let's go and I can't skip that because I don't have a keyboard connected by the way I'm using a Bluetooth mouse and my tablet is currently plugged in into the wall charger so yeah if you have a Bluetooth keyboard and a mouse you can use both and you can totally get rid of the, the wires and stuff and it's still loading oh, there we go it's a bit longer than what it would have taken if I had installed it on the SSD but I'm gonna go ahead click watch and spectate one of the live games so that you guys can see how long it takes for the game to load um, I'm gonna spectate this game here It's still loading, come on. It 
anyways guys if you have any questions about this just leave a comment in the comment section or send me a PM I'll be glad to answer your questions and yeah it's still loading I'm gonna wait till it's loaded and yeah there we go as you can see it's a lot slower than what it would have been on the SSD but yeah it does work it's running off of the SD card micro SD other than that when the game is loaded there's absolutely no lag yeah it's working alright so yeah guys that's about it for this video and uh, I thank you all for watching and thank you all for the positive response that I've got and if you have a question leave a comment below or send me a message and guys press the like button it helps a lot it helps me motivate to make more videos and yeah leave your questions in the comment section thank you guys for watching stay tuned for more